nine years old um, was about the time the Lord got a hold of me. Um, of, of all the times I'd heard the gospel in, uh, in church, it was at an elementary school during the lunch hour. And um, somebody came, I don't know what his name was or what he preached on, but I remember the deep convicting realization that I was a sinner and that I needed the Lord for the first time, that, that there, this was going to be unbearable unless the Lord came in and saved me. I knew that there had to be a change that only He could do. Henry Blackerby used to talk about spiritual markers, and that always resonated with my experience as I think back on um, how the Lord got a hold of me. So nine years old was definitely the first. And then um, coming up to camp, um, all the way from Miami, Florida, I came to North Carolina for summer camp. And um, there was one campfire service in particular, I remember on a Friday night, and the pastor, the camp director was giving the, the gospel presentation. And I was like, man, I've heard this so many times. I could tell him exactly what he's saying before he says it, word for word. And I remember looking up, there was a lot of trees, but then you could see just straight up into the stars above the site where we were at. And I, I believe the Lord talked to me and he said, uh, he said, Jack, and I said, yeah. And he said, feed my sheep. Definitely struggle with depression in the past. And um, I remember um, being upstairs in my parents' house at one point and I was so down, maybe more down than I've ever been. And I thought, I'm a believer. Um, this life is such a drag. Um, nothing's working out. I'm just going to hang out until I die and I'm with the Lord and that'll be fine. And I was, I was in Psalms, and Psalm 27, 13 says, um, I would have despaired unless I had believed that I would see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Be strong, let your heart take courage, and wait for the Lord. And the promise in that passage is not to wait to the end and have goodness in heaven, the promise is that we will have goodness in this life. I have served uh, different churches. I've been involved in several churches. Um, been on staff. Seen seen a lot from the inside out. I've never been so excited about a church. The Lord's moving. God is about resurrection, and He's about redeeming a people for Himself. It makes me encouraged and, uh, and hopeful. And I find a lot of joy in communicating that to other people. When I can say, you, you may be going through a difficult season, but the Lord is a redeeming God. And He's in the business of resurrection. And He's done some incredible things in my life in spite of me.